So, Hare Krishna, this is Hare Krishna. This is Navina Niradadas from Shira Mayapur, and I'm talking with my dear friend Radhika Raman Prabhu, who is in Tokyo, Japan. And the question is what is your realization about book distribution in Japan? Well, but uh, since Japan is one of the most intense materialistic countries and the, uh, the epitome of Mayava consciousness is found here, it's a, a great challenge every day to come out on the street and see, uh, see the people, connect with them and uh, study your personal spiritual life this way. Uh, how, long, how long have you been in Japan so far? 25 years. Wow. Uh, <laughs> it's a long time. <laughs> but you know, Japan is unique in a way. I'm not approaching people with any uh, constructive uh, uh, a plan to impress them mentally or intellectually because the uh, culture here is so I would say different and, and very unique and bizarre in some ways. Uh, you, you have the only way how you can connect people is to really uh, pray to Lord Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and Lord Chichananda for mercy so you can really connect to people heart to heart. So and, the heart, uh, co heart to heart connection is what makes a difference, what gets them to put their phones yeah, down and to look at you. That's the only way here. You can have exercise uh, some kind of attempt to humility. Uh, to be, you know, to actually like uh, give up your a certain uh, preconceptions of, uh, of of your qualification or anything like that. You have to really like just be depending on Krishna and see where is the where is the guide of Krishna. I think that this is a tool which works everywhere. You gotta really see uh, where Krishna wants to take you. And book has its own address before even it comes out, out of the temple. So we got to like, uh, just see how, uh, where, what is Krishna's plan, you know, which is basically the same scenario everywhere, if, you know, distributing in New York, in the, doing a concerts in America, or doing it in Japan. Japan is a, a sweet place because you really have to uh, try people heart to heart. And, and that's uh, something which sometimes goes and sometimes it doesn't go. So Thank sometimes you. it becomes difficult and sometimes it becomes really ecstatic. <laughs> well, you look pretty blissful there. Can you tell us uh, your realizations? You're doing everyday worship of Sri Sri Radha Govinda and you're dressing the deities and taking care of the Lord. So what's your realization of combining deity worship and book distribution? Is that something that's compatible? Is that something that works or... Well, for me, it was always a, a, the only way to go because Japan, we used to travel. We didn't go to temples. We didn't stay in a temple. So we stayed in hotels and I was sometimes in hotels for month to, month after month. So uh, I, was, uh, I was relying on the association of the deities, you know. So I was always having a Govardhan Shila with me and first Gurditai deities. And, and that platform of uh, practicing Madhurya, you know, a, a, a sweet association of the deities, and uh, that uh, that shelter that I got from the from my from my uh, uh, seva to the deity uh, was for me the platform to go out and and uh, rely on that that experience of consciousness and and also because the deity is a uh, also deity is a. Uh, uh, a, a form of Krishna which projects to our heart so the the, the, the the manifestation of the Lord comes from the heart from within our heart projects to the deity the deity becomes the mirror for the Lord to, to show us his glories and his beauty so the deity worship it really carries the beauty of Krishna within us and then when we go out on a, on a street people recognize the beauty of Krishna you know, people look at your eyes sometimes and they say your eyes are really pretty or beautiful. And I am, I clearly understand that it's Krishna is staring through my eyes there to their face. And until I get empty, you know, because we, we got to exercise every day uh, to re reinvent that that experience of Krishna consciousness. I pray to Govardhan, I do Govardhan and do, do uh, Gorjata, I did this every day. 
uh, to manifest in my heart the sweetness and that the magnanimity of, of mercy so people feel that there is something very wonderful but, you know through me I pray that I can become that instrument on a daily basis because we get emptied out by the association of the material energy so we have to chant we have to read we have to see the deities every day and recollect our uh, you know the, the sanctity and the transparency of our Krishna consciousness so we can we can uh, give people that as, as good association thank you for sharing <laughs> that's more than okay that's wonderful thank you for sharing your time and your realizations with all of the devotees and yeah, thank you very much for we wish you a blissful uh, marathon there in Tokyo Japan don't freeze there's no freezing time yet. Not yet. Soon <laughs> to come. My sweater is inside of the bag. Still. Okay. But it's it's ready to go. All right. Okay. Thank you so much. Hare Krishna. Thank you. All goes to the Prabhupada. All goes to your service. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna. Hare Krishna.